A contract signing exercise was recently conducted at the Albion Community Center ground. Details in this report. Construction of new infrastructure and rehabilitation of existing infrastructure is now underway as 268 road contracts were signed recently for over $10 billion being invested on the development of roads and streets in Region 6. This was all facilitated at a contract signing ceremony at the Albion Community Center ground and it was attended by the Vice President Dr. Barrett Jagdio along with six government ministers, Nigel Dharamalal, Ashni Singh, Juan Ejil, Diodat Indar, Zulfikar Mustafa, and Kwame McCoy. Dr. Jagdio made these remarks during the event. We, are, we have already completed over 100, or the contract has been awarded. Some are being completed, some are on the way to be completed. And um, today we are here now, we're over 200 more roads, with about 268 contracts, but over 200 roads will be awarded. That will keep the promise that we made, that over 300 roads will be done this, this year. Additionally, he explained, So we decided we're only in the future going to do concrete roads or asphaltic roads. So if we do asphalt roads, we have a major problem because one, weather. We have not had a dry period only now, maybe in the last year and a half. To do asphaltic work, even to prepare and, and lay the asphalt, you need proper weather conditions. That's one, and we have not been having that in Ghana. So everything gets delayed. Secondly, you have a limited number of people who can do this work. So you invariably have to go to the same people over and over again because they have the equipment to lay the asphalt and everything else and then they have a huge set of projects and they're not completing the projects. Further, he revealed that the construction of these roads caused the government to increase the budget for this project. We had four billion in the budget, and that we probably have to increase by another four billion dollars to get this done. Well, it will be close to ten billion dollars that's being spent on roads in this region this year, and these are just community roads. So. This is essential. This is not the end. Next year, we have to do another set of roads. He also appealed to all contractors to desist from providing substandard works. If you have to, to put two inches of crusher on, please put the two inches of crusher on. If we, when we test that and we find that any one of those things are not met, no, no, you're not getting another contract. You're not getting another contract. Additionally, he hinted to other development slated for Region 6. So that's what we're now looking at. But, they, but already contracts about the cost of $10 billion have been awarded to do 99 bridges, structures on the main road to widen them. Then now, if we're going with the four lane, we probably have to amend those contracts to widen them even further, the, the, the structures, so they can accommodate the entire four lane road. While over 300 roads are expected to be repaired or constructed in 2022, the infrastructural development will continue in 2023 as more deplorable roads are earmarked for repair. Narima Ali. Channel 8 News.